the Koch videos are sponsored by the Little Rail House of Wellingborough. Hello you beautiful lot, it's Purple and I'm at the Wizard's Tower. Now, in preparation for tomorrow's big video, um, I've got a little video that I found that I would like to show you all. So it is about Earthling Borough Mines um, and it was part of Ebervale in Wales. It was part of the um, promotional videos to say about the mechanisation of the mine and how it's one of the first of the country. I think it was the first. Um, so yeah, I just want to put that all together. Um, at the same time, I've been very quiet on Facebook and everything, and I do apologise for that. You've seen the videos, but you haven't really heard much of me. Um, I've been a very busy boy, and you'll like this. So, as you know, with the donations, I managed to get myself a Preceiver 947 Mark 7 wood-burning pen. Right? And I've made this. Right? It's awesome. I've got to shade in the, uh, the lettering. <laughs> but we now have a board for the cotch. And it's going to be a nice sign, finally. So um, thank you for the donations. Thank you so much, especially for the, um, for the pen. That is definitely uh, something I really wanted to do. So thank you for that. Um, but yeah, enough of that. Let me show you this video of the mines. Now it is black and white um, and they were silent films. It looks like it's been, it's all explained in the video. But just remember, this is in preparation for Sunday's huge video, which you're going to love. The Ebervale Mines of Earthlingborough. Enjoy. <laughs> how we used to do it. The place has changed very little outwardly. This old film was recently unearthed at Ebba Vale. Nowadays we go two and a quarter miles in from the tunnel mouth and the roadways in the ironstone total many miles. The old film was silent, of course, which accounts for the apparent great speed of working in those days, and of reading, for that matter. You see, silent film is taken at a rate of 16 frames a second, whereas today's sound projectors show 24 pictures per second, so that this film is moving at one and a half times the speed of actuality. That means that they were not working quite so fast as the film indicates. As you see from the titles, this film was made by the British Thompson Houston Company, probably to celebrate the new electrification which they just accomplished, making Earthlingborough the first iron ore mine to be electrically mechanized. All this, of course, is exactly as it's still done today. There are faces here still to be remembered. Can you spot Bill Osborne? who retired a few weeks ago, or others. It seems as though they worked in their Sunday best suits in those days.
all this is 33 years ago. Does it faintly remind you of, say, Charlie Chaplin in Shoulder Arms? Or Pearl White being saved from the oncoming express? It does look rather as though there's a power cut, except that they didn't have them in those days. That was before the days of sintering. But not too bad for 33 years ago. 